I, I know, I know. You're weighing your options. You've already invested significantly in Magento or Adobe Commerce. Your processes in this platform, they're well established. Your theme is aging. Your code base is a little bit long in the tooth. You're finding out that e-commerce also faces mortality. So what do you do? I'll tell you what you're going to do. In this video, I'll present five reasons why Whova as a new theme for your Adobe Commerce website is your best choice. It's supported by thousands of merchants who have already made the leap. And if you are leaning toward Whova already, this will be that gentle nudge that'll push you straight into Whova's loving arms. But if you do want to balance your decisions, I have a video right up here with five reasons why Whova is probably not the best fit for you as well. Well, let's jump in. Reason number one is Whova isn't this experimental technology that you're beta testing for the community at large. It's well established and it is battle tested. Whova was launched in 2020 and has quickly become the go-to solution for Magento websites. We're talking thousands of implementations across stores of all sizes, small, all the way up to enterprise sites. In fact, I would go so far as to say it's backwards for any agency to release a new Magento website and have it be on Luma. There's much better options and Whova is a fantastic choice. The good news is that most agencies like us here at Swift Otter, we've embraced this as a solid option for the right merchant. One of Whova's core tenets was module compatibility, and that was key for it to even get any type of success. And they have done nothing short of a fabulous job with this. It's pretty close to all major modules at this point are now Whova compatible. But this isn't the only thing that makes Whova a no-brainer. But wait, there's more! Number two reason is that Whova is a no risk evolution. This is really important. It's not throwing away everything that you currently have and have already built on your Adobe Commerce platform. And just to start over with, it's evolution, not revolution. Your entire Magento backend stays the same. All your products, customers, orders, admin workflows, everything is untouched. You're just upgrading your customer experience or the storefront and not migrating or rebuilding your entire business. Compare this to switching platforms where you are looking at data migration, learning new admin systems, retraining the staff, crossing your fingers that nothing breaks. It is a clean break to get exactly what you want, but with Whova, your team can keep working exactly as they always have been while their customers get a better experience. It truly is the lowest risk way to refresh your customer experience and keep your admin staff happy with the system that they've been using for the past X number of years. But not only is Whova low risk, it also brings a new functional roadmap. So don't think that low risk also means low reward. Reason number three is Whova comes with an incredible feature set. Now, to be specific, I'm talking about Whova Commerce, which does have a nominal yearly fee, and I consider it to be very reasonably nominal. If you're going with Whova, their commerce offering is as well a no-brainer. Whova gives the front-end experience a complete overhaul. And if your development partner is qualified like us here at Swift Otter, you can count on super good core web vital page speed scores like in the 90s. Wow. But then add on top of that, with Whova Commerce, you get a new admin design, a better image editor, and what I think most everyone is most excited about is a all new content management system or CMS experience. So long page builder. For about 3,500 US dollars a year, it's, it is so easy to show how it's gonna pay for itself. Their roadmap is significant and it is public. And the interesting thing is that most of it does focus on building a full on content management system directly into Magento. And don't forget that technically another feature is the fact that developers do love working with Whova. It's modern. And if you remember, most of Adobe Commerce was built with technology from 2012. And if we're being honest with ourselves, it's a little painful. A good piece of that is then kicked to the curb with Whova and developers 
absolutely love it. But Hoover's value doesn't actually stop there. There's two more reasons. Reason number four is that Hoover continues to iterate. One thing that has really impressed me about the Hoover team is how quickly they iterate and they're continuously improving their system. They released the theme, pushed hard to get widespread module compatibility, but they didn't stop. And this is partially due to some of the incredibly bright minds behind Whova. They hired some great engineers and built a checkout. And now they've built Whova Commerce, a layer that fits perfectly on top of Magento. Vinay Kopp, personal friend of mine, absolutely incredibly brilliant person and has poured his soul into making Whova the product that it is today. Willem, others, an incredible team of people that are keeping the lights on for Whova and most importantly, making sure it is an incredibly good fit for Magento merchants across the board. But that being said, they constantly release updates, new features, performance improvements, additional extension compatibility. In the past year, they've, they've added support for even more popular extensions, improved performance, and of course, they're always making tweaks to make the developer experience better. And I always appreciate how they do actively listen to the community. This is not a build it once, and then make money for the rest of your life sort of solution. They are actively evolving and investing to meet real merchant needs. So when you invest, and when I say invest, it's not like a massive investment. It's a tiny investment when actually purchasing the Hoofa product. You're not just buying what exists today. You're getting access to continuous improvements to keep your store at the cutting edge. And that's even if you buy the one time license fee to just only access the theme. That's impressive. Speaking of which, we do have a clear winner for the final reason to go with Hoover, and that is minimal ongoing costs. It's the subject that nobody kind of likes to talk about, but everybody has to talk about it at some point, and that is the money for the Hoover theme. It is a $3,500, roughly US dollars, one-time payment for the theme. Or if you wanna go with the full Whova suite of offerings, it's about that same amount every year. Considering Adobe's licensing fees for the Adobe Commerce product are many times this, $3,500 is just a no brainer. And I appreciate very much companies that can figure out how to make volume work such that the prices are low and easy to swallow. The price is not a barrier for Whova whatsoever. Most merchants see the licensing cost pay for itself within the first month through improved conversion rates alone. Plus, because Whova makes development faster and easier, your ongoing maintenance costs should actually decrease. And remember, Whova keeps your existing Magento platform status quo. No big changes, no challenges with retraining or bringing people up to speed on a new system. It just works. You're replacing the customer experience with a much more modern, constantly updated system. That's five reasons why Whova is a complete winning decision for your team. It's proven, low risk, feature rich, constantly improving, and it's surprisingly affordable. If you're interested in learning about how Whova will impact your e-commerce experience and your organization as a whole, feel free to reach out to me, joseph at swiftotter.com. I would love to provide some guidance, introduce you to our team who has experience with Whova to be able to help you make the right decision for your company, given all the variables that are at play, which does make those decisions kind of hard to make. We have a lot of experience in that department, and we would be more than happy to help you. Until next time.